Hey guys, this is Eberly, and this is a quick video to show how to summon specters in a Pledge of Hands without having to deal with the pain of dealing with Greater Spell Echo and having to detonate corpses to make sure you only have one target, all of that stuff. So basically, this is important because if you want to use specters in a Pledge of Hands, uh, it's kind of annoying to, su to resummon specters because uh, it's going to force it to repeat three times if, if you take out the Spell Echo gem. And obviously that is not ideal. But there is a way to get around this. Basically, the first thing you need to know is where your Ray Spectre gem is going to be socketed. Ideally it's in the first three sockets, otherwise you are going to need a staff and uh, that is linked up to the point where your Ray Spectre is socketed. So say I have it in socket number four, I will need this staff uh, for later. So basically, what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to use a different weapon to summon your specters. If you have it in the first three sockets, you can use a one-hander. Um, so if it's in socket number two, this is the second socket is where you would put it. For this, I will use socket number three in the wand. So basically, this doesn't have to be on weapon swap or anything. You just throw it on, but. Anyways, you will just summon your specters as normal, just through that wand, no links or whatever. Just get all your specters, let's just say all of those are the same. And then you're gonna go to town. You have to go to town, doesn't work in hideout because you will kill your specters otherwise. Town, you don't have your specters. You're gonna take out the ray specter gem that you just used and you're gonna socket it into the same number socket on the Pledge of Hands. So I use number three socket, this is the third socket over here. And as you can see when you go back you can also put your links back in or whatever. All my specters are still alive and they now have the links from the Pledge of Hands and yeah. So this makes it a lot easier to summon specters when you're using a Pledge of Hands. Just wanted to make this very quickly. And uh, yeah. Anyways, this is really signing off. Hopefully some full videos soon, some more guide stuff and all of that. And yeah, I will see you guys later.